Welcome back to Tutorial Tidbits. I'm Elizabeth St. Hilaire and this week I want to show you how to apply Simple Gold Leaf. Simple Gold Leaf is a product that is much more shiny and metallic than any metallic gold paint could ever hope to be. So when you want that extra special bit of bling in your artwork, something that really needs to be pure gold, you want to use Simple Gold Leaf. Simple Gold Leaf with transfer papers is the kind that I prefer the most and also you're going to want to use the specific adhesive that is made for this product and they're both created by Speedball. All the products for my tutorials are always in my Amazon shopping list. Let's go check it out. It's a simple process and once I show you how easy it is, I know you're going to love it. So I am going to be showing you a sneak peek um, as I apply this gold leaf to my upcoming fashion plate portraits online workshop. So the uh, gold leaf application is just one element of that um, workshop that's upcoming. It's going to be lots of fun and you can get information on that on my website. So, um, and also join my mailing list. If you're on my mailing list, you're absolutely, you will absolutely get all the info on upcoming workshops, both online and in person. So I've got, um, Speedball Mona Lisa um, adhesive sizing, and this is the specific adhesive product that you use with the Simple Leaf. And the Simple Leaf, you want to make sure you are using the one with the transfer papers. That is my preferred Simple Leaf, definitely with the transfer papers and also by Speedball Mona Lisa. I've got a small paintbrush uh, for applying my um, adhesive because I am working on these earrings right here and they have uh, relatively small points at the top and I want to make sure I'm using a brush that allows me to apply the adhesive very specifically in the area of these earrings. You are going to um, shake up the leaf or uh, gently, very gently uh, kind of blend the uh, leaf adhesive. Uh, you don't want to shake it up too much because it'll get a lot of bubbles, but if you don't uh, blend it together, it doesn't work right. So let's do that first. So we're going to take the brush, dip it in the adhesive size, and then we're going to apply it very carefully exactly where we want the leaf, the gold leaf to be. So I'm going to go over these, the entire uh, round part of these earrings. I'll go back and consider adding the uh, teal marks on top again at the end. So I'm just gonna apply it generously and completely. It goes on a little milky white, so it's you can sort of see where you're applying it if you apply it a little thicker. If you apply it thin, it's kind of clear, so you have to sort of make sure you've got it exactly where you want it. Now, once that I've brushed that on exactly where I want it, I need to let it dry. But in the meantime, I'm gonna make sure that I clean this brush because this adhesive size is very sticky and it has the potential to really ruin your brush. So you want to make sure that you clean it with the master's brush cleaner and get all the stickiness, um, all the adhesive size out of the brush. In the meantime, we're going to let this dry. Now, um, one of my favorite tools for the studio is the um, desk fan that I use that just circulates room temperature air across this so no heat but it helps to speed the drying time what you want to achieve with this adhesive size is you want it to dry so that when you touch it it's very tacky it's not wet but it's dry and it's tacky once it gets to a tacky state then it is ready to put the leaf into but that time is going to depend on your climate and the temperature where you are. When you're in the desert, this is going to happen much faster. When you're in a very humid climate, this is going to happen slower. Right now, it's cold where I am, and things are also drying slower than it's cold. So you're going to have to use the, the, the touch test, and you're going to wait for this to get to the point where it is dry and tacky. Your finger is going to stick to the glue. It's not going to feel wet, and that's when it's going to be ready to apply the simple metallic leaf. 
Now that the uh, adhesive sizing is dry, you're going to take the, uh, the gold leaf on the transfer paper and the shiny side, the metallic leaf side, is gonna go down into the sizing, the glue, and then you're going to, I like to use the surface of my fingernails. You could use the back of a spoon or whatever you want, but you're going to burnish or basically rub with a hard surface the metallic leaf into the glue. You wanna get a real good contact. And then you simply pull up the transfer paper and then you brush it off. You should be able to brush it off in the areas where there was no sizing. So the opening of our earring should come through. There you have the simple gold metallic leaf applied to the areas where you brush on with the uh, adhesive made by the same company.